Uh, yeah, um, I got an email and, um, I don't understand what this is. I don't, I have a PayPal account, but I don't have a business account. Ma'am, can you hear from your first name or last name? So I'll go ahead and check in my system. Yeah, it's Kathy Wilson. Sorry, ma'am. Kathy Wilson. Okay, okay ma'am. So just bear with me. I'll check in my system, okay? All right. Ma'am, as I can see in my system, you did a charge for $249.99 and the 99 cents for the merchant piece of PayPal business account, right? Um, I didn't, um, <clears throat> excuse me. I didn't open a PayPal business account. I just have my regular PayPal account. So I guess this is identity theft, okay, like your message so, says. Ma'am, it's okay. Do you remember, have you ever shared your post information to anybody, like your family members or friends who might have used your fake PayPal business account? No, no, no none of my friends or family would open up a fake pay or open up a, pay a PayPal account in my name. They wouldn't do that. Mm -hmm. Ma'am, it sounds like somebody is misusing your post information to make this kind of fraud activities with you, Miss. Someone is stolen your identity and your post information. That's why you get the notification to our site. Okay? So do you want to unauthorized charge? Well, the thing is, I already, I logged into my PayPal and I called my bank and there is no two hundred forty nine ninety nine charge at my bank or in my PayPal account. Okay, what is the amount you have in your bank account? Uh, what's the balance in my checking account? Yeah, miss. Why do you need to know that? Ma'am, so the amount is already detected to your account. That's why I'm no, it hasn't, you. sir. I called my bank and they said they don't see any charge for two forty nine ninety nine or any upcoming charges for two forty nine ninety nine. Okay, okay. So, so do you want to get to this unauthorized charge, ma'am? Well, I guess so if, I they, if they made it, if they made an account in my name, then they didn't use any of my credit card mm -hmm. information. They just opened up a new thing, and you mm -hmm. said, as you said, it's probably identity theft. So I just canceled the account because I didn't open it, and I know I won't get charged the two forty nine ninety nine, and I think we're good then, right? All right, Miss. So, in order to cancel this transaction, first I have to connect you with our banking secured server. Then I need to fill up online cancellation form. Okay, why do I Once have to fill out a cancellation form, form for something I didn't do? I didn't do this. All right, you you already know it's identity theft, as it says that if you haven't signed up for a PayPal business call immediately, as uh -huh. this may be a case of identity theft. All right, we've established that it's identity theft. Uh, I shouldn't have to fill out a little form okay. to cancel something. I it's not me. Okay, Miss, so I'll guide you to get the cancellation form. So are you in front of a computer or a laptop? All right, sir, did you just so hear I what I just you? said? I shouldn't have to fill out a form. This, okay, this is not me. Why should I fill out a cancellation form for something that's identity theft? Some thief has stolen my name. Information, some thief might have created them, but somebody, someone is creating a PayPal business account. With right, your yes, which is identity, identity theft. theft. Which is I so Yes, exactly, you? which is identity theft. And I need to call so, I mean, the people who... So, I mean, in order to cancel you need to fill up all and cancel this form. That's why I'm asking All right, let me speak to a manager. Let me form. speak to a manager because this is ridiculous. I don't think you're understanding. I said it's identity theft. I'm agreeing with you. I shouldn't have to fill out any stupid form to cancel something when I didn't even do it. Ma'am, I think you don't understand what I'm saying, right? Oh my God. <sighs> I do I understand exactly what you're saying. Somebody has used my social security number. Some rotten, dirty thief has taken my social security number and opened up a PayPal business account, but it doesn't have any of my billing information mm -hmm. because it's not me. So I'm not worried about any charge. Just cancel the, the business account. Or let me speak to a manager so I can tell him what he what needs to be done. Are you new? Um, Ma'am, who is getting charged? You or me? Okay, okay, so I don't know who will get charged. So I guess they opened up a new bank account in my name, which doesn't have any of my money in it. Mm -hmm. and, and if it goes there and you guys charge that, then I don't know what's going to happen. It ain't going to come out of my money, so I'm not worried about that. I'm worried because now my identity is at risk. 
Man, someone is hacking information. I under okay. I That's it's not why. it's not a hack. It's just some but some dirty thief has stolen my social security number so they can take uh, money and make accounts in my name. I know how it works. Can I please speak to a supervisor? Um, I think you are wasting my time, right? Oh my God! Look, okay, okay, you are newer, or you're the rudest customer service rep I've ever talked to. Wasting your time? No, sir, I am not. May, may I please speak to your supervisor? Really, you coward! You hung up. <laughs> Thank you for calling. How may I help you today? Yeah, can I please speak to the supervisor? I just talked to somebody and we got disconnected. He didn't seem to understand what was happening and I need to speak to somebody about this, please. To whom you were talking, ma'am? I don't know. He didn't give me his name. Okay, so can you please verify me your name so I can go ahead and ask him about you? Kathy Wilson. Wilson. Yeah. Okay, Miss Wilson, just hold on. Okay. Okay. All right, ma'am. So what was the purpose of this call? Because the person to whom you talked previous is not free right now, so he just told me to talk with you. So what was the purpose to call? I called because you guys sent an email that said that um, I opened a PayPal business account, verified through my social security number. I didn't do that, and I was trying to tell the guy. Well, it also at the end of this of this email, it says if you haven't signed up for a PayPal business call immediately, as this may be identity theft. So I'm calling immediately to let you know it's identity theft. But then he said I need to fill out a form to cancel something that. <laughs> That, yeah. I, that I didn't even do. This okay, this isn't me, so this this guy is probably this person has opened up a bank account which doesn't have any of my money in it, so I'm not worried about this charge. I'm more worried about the identity theft going on. And why you are calling? If you don't get any money deducted, then why you are calling for help? Because on the okay, at the end of your little statement it says if you haven't signed up for PayPal business call immediately, is this may be a case of identity theft. So that's what I did. And not you or cancel this charge. You need to be in front of your computer or laptop for sure. Because if you want to fill up a cancellation form, then you need to be in front of your computer or laptop. Okay. So are you in front of uh, your computer uh, or laptop you know, right uh, now? Can you please explain to me why I need to fill out a form to cancel a business account that I didn't make that's a, that I'm a, when I'm a victim of identity theft? Because the thing is, ma'am, ma'am, the thing is that you were not requested for this. And as I can see here, that someone have the access of your personal account and your personal information. For that, you are receiving such kind of emails and charges under your name. So we need to stop that person. We need to track down that person, whoever is using your information. For that, you need to fill up a cancellation okay. form to cancel this charge. I'm sorry. And that's the not, reason you are not That's not what this email to, says. This email says your to request to open a PayPal business account has been processed. Somebody opened up a different, bank, a different PayPal account, a business account. This has nothing to do with my personal account. But ma'am, if you need to cancel this charge, then you need to open up any of your internet browser. And the other thing is that there is not only one charge under your name. There are multiple charges using your name, using your information. And you will not get charged for only 249 You will get charged for more than $3,700. So do you want to lose your money? Okay, quit being so nasty. I don't like your attitude, for one. So back off on the attitude, lady. Where's the thirty-seven hundred dollars coming from? Where's that? That doesn't. That has nothing to do with this email here. That's from your checking account, and probably you will not be able to see the charge right now because okay. it was not authorized All right. by you. They said, okay, if there, okay, if there is a, a checking account that's on this business account that I did not open, tell me the last four digits of that checking account so I can see if it matches mine. Why do I need to tell you? Because it's your personal information. Because I'm just trying to ask you to do a simple thing. I'm going to thing. ask you your... Oh my God, I ask you to do a simple thing. Can you verify that checking you, account? If I am going to ask you your account number, then are you able to give your account number and your bank name to me? 
No, just because you will not be I able to ask, share any I kind asked of you to ver I didn't, I'm not, I don't know, ma'am. I asked you to verify what the checking account is associated. Just wait for the charge, ma'am. Oh my just God. Just wait for the charge, ma'am. I don't want to argue. I don't want to argue and waste my time. Oh my God. What is this? It's wasting your time. Charge, you you people, I, don't, I hate that America outsourced to wherever the hell you are because you people are incompetent and rude. Tell me what bank account is associated with this business account, lady. If you want to cancel this charge, ma'am, then you can call and ask for my name. My name is Jerry. Okay? Okay, can I speak to a supervisor? I asked a simple question. To... What bank account is on this business account? The last four. That's all I'm asking. So see if it matches I... mine. I am the supervisor here, and the another thing is that we are not allowed to share any kind of personal information to anyone because it's the recorded line. If I'm going to oh share, then I might Oh my God in heaven! Oh my so God! I asked you for the last job. four digits of the checking account to see what. To, you're not helping me no. at all. You're making this extremely difficult. Why? Because you are not there with me. Well, I guess I'll just have to call Norton LifeLock and ask them what the hell is going on and get my identity protected through them because you're no help at all. Okay. You're useless. Okay. You are okay. absolutely useless. Okay. Bye. You, you too. Bye. That felt good. I really don't like those she-devils. I really, really, really don't like them.